Testing. Okay, that seems fine. All right. Time to get back to some Crimson Vow drafting. I missed out on drafting last Friday. I forgot that thing. So this is episode four. Um, I believe I got a token from because I unlocked the mastery pass already. Might as well use this. I used to save the token for the next one, but eh. it's all the same. Okay, so our last two drafts weren't great. B basically, the drafts I've done since I've gotten to gold weren't great. So let's hope for something good today. Alchemist's Gambit! Okay, one of the reasons I'm probably not doing too well is this because I've been rare drafting too much. So let's try not to rare draft the Parasitic Grasp. Seems fairly good. I feel like it's super easy to get drawn into playing black because there's always a lot of good removal. This one, this one is definitely removal. Nice. You could get a breed. I haven't played red yet in this format. So I think I'll get a breed. Red black is uh Vampires, I believe. Alright, this is fairly good with like the blood tokens. Let's try one of it. Although, we seem to be getting cut from black okay let's get random red creature okay so this is a go wide attack oh, okay I guess we're doing this Although our creatures are humans, we should get more vampires. Hello, um, what's your name? Axi, four lies. Okay, we haven't actually gotten any vampires yet. But we do have a bunch of removal, which is typical for red black, I guess. Not forcing anything. It does feel like we're being cut off from black. One would assume we would... Blue seems open though. Uh, none of these are particularly good. Although... Well, uh, let's just get this lightning wolf. We'll get our black vampires on the second pack maybe. Overall, this draft is not shaping up well. Oh, our rare came back to us. Okay, we might as well. I missed the chance to get a vampire. Because I rare drafted. Actually, if your deck is overly aggressive, I can see you playing this. I can see playing this. 
The problem is the cleave cost is off color for us. What's your opinion on this being a bomb format? That seems fairly true, which makes removal like Grizzly Ritual a lot more uh, important. Like, there are some ridiculous bombs. Like that big blue creature that uh, you can bounce a thing every time. Every time you cast a spell. Or that... Uh, there's like a 6-6 six, six flying demon where you sacrifice a creature every upkeep and it creates a copy of itself. Then there's that green uh, hexproof werewolf that puts plus one plus one counters on another creature you control every turn. There's a bunch of bombs, definitely. But there's also actually a decent amount of answers. This is a maybe. It's too bad we are not in those colors. Get this. Oh wait. Removal again. Nice. Okay. Oh wow. So many rares. Okay, there's nothing too good here, so I'll get this rare. Justifying it. Get this. Alright, so I'm not big on one ones, but this one comes with like draw card, well, loot, rummage. So it's not too bad, maybe. Howling Moon. Howling Moon. Oh, I'm Howling Mine. How many vampires do we have? We need more vampires. Let's just get this. Would you consider it? I'm already in black! Blah blah blah. Okay, this is pretty decent as a finisher, like when you have. Maybe six or more lands already. Okay, we get it. Hello Maru, welcome back to the stream. Right, let's get this blocker guy. What's our curve look like? Okay, we have a lot of removal at two. Skulking Killer! Uh, this is okay. This is also okay. So many vampires. Uh, I think Falconrath celebrant. Is better than Magma Pummeler. We can cast and cut Magma Pummeler. Okay, so this this guy can be triggered by our blood tokens. Oh, you two know each other.
Oh, nice. Threaten. Oh, look, there's that bomb we were talking about. <laughs> we summoned it. We willed it into existence. Any life key. This might work. It might be true that black is the best color in the format. I don't know. Wedding security. Oh, this is also fairly good. Let's cut these silly humans. Okay, let's get life link D. We accept you, human. Ancestral anger is super gimmicky, but if you if you get lucky, you can draft like two or th three or four of them. Alright, we'll cut Tiny Vampire. I also have yet to win when drafting red. Right, I think I'll cut that wolf. One of you. That's not for to cast wolf. Sorry, lightning wolf, I'm cutting you. I, I think I'm cutting this. I have a bigger bomb. Don't need a second threaten. Oh wow, we got a rare. Directly proportional or inversely proportional? This actually isn't bad. Wedding invitation. Alright, let's see what we got. I think I'll probably cut the werewolves. We have some tribal vampire removal. And that's it. 40 cards. And, and vampires. Actually, that worked out reasonably well. We'll go for this.
Uh, this is Val Draft Five. Okay, I, I I feel good about this draft. We have a bunch of removal. We have an actual bomb. We have a couple of ways to recur the bomb. We have a decent curve. Might actually worked out. Well, I, I I don't know if it's my best deck so far in this format. The the blue black I had that went that got seven wins. It was also fairly good. Okay. These are terrible guys to have in my opening hand, but we're going first, so okay. Panic bystander. Okay. Getting a lot of Discord notifs. Maru, is that you? The thing about this dominating vampires, we don't actually have uh, a sacrifice outlet. So he's in he's on blue white spirits. Which is fine, but he's going to have a lot of flyers, which is going to be annoying. Oh no. I can steal this, but why? Let's do this first. Well, why not? Predicting 5-3. Oh, he countered it. That's weird. Okay. Okay, so we can attack. Attack. He'll go to 14. I go to 8 on the counter attack. I think we'll just block. I'm totally sacrificing this magma pomular to that demon when it comes out. Right, so we're going to 10. Oh no, he's going to eat it! Oh well. Where are my blood tokens at? Why does he have more blood tokens than me? Alright! Alright, let's wait until we have more stuff. Hold the line, Squire. 
Aha, be our guest. It's time for blood. I should have played the swamp. Right, so... He's hoping to cash in on the disturb, I guess. Alright, now we are slightly ahead and we have blood tokens. That's fine. Brian Comber, okay. Right, so here's what we'll do. Madness. Did I gain life this turn? I did not. Okay, so he's going to put the thing on his infantry. That probably doesn't save him. I mean, I'm still just going to attack. Alright. Maru is predicting 5-3 with no basis whatsoever. Wow, the blood tokens were great. The blood tokens 
we got to dig through like four different lands with the blood tokens. And we also got to do the Edward's Awakening Madness. Twenty percent of the way there. We didn't even use our bomb. I guess the blood tokens are fairly decent. Uh, oh, that's terrible. If you have a bomb in your deck, since they help you dig towards getting it out. Okay. This is 100% a mulligan. Do not misclick. Do not misclick. Do not misclick. Mulligan. Okay, this one. <laughs> okay. Uh, uh, not the best, but okay. We'll send back celebrants, I think. Core your bat. Oh no. Okay lang mamaya na. Okay, what happened? Desperate farmer. Oh, right. I totally wasn't paying attention. Let's just play the map. Didn't play the swamp to make him think I'm on blue black. The thing about that kind of play is um, it does have some psychological advantage but also it might make me be dumb well i was i was already dumb so okay tiny dudes Okay, we're not we're not going to activate that trigger anytime soon. Okay, I did activate that trigger, but it had no effect. It's like an opportunity for me to make a mistake. Like um How to explain? What was a scenario where I where not playing the mountain would have been a mistake? I guess not really. I didn't have a double red card in hand. Yeah, I should have played the swamp. I guess. Very small percentage on, on that. Sure. Accidentally blooding the mountain there. Basically an opportunity for me to be dumb. Okay, we'll accept that. Oh wow, 
Okay, um... I think I'll just get back the Skull King Killer, so I have something that can kill the Lifelink dude. Wait, it's into play! It's actually, actually turned out better than I expected. Oh, so when I do the madness thing, it's into hand. But when I cast it normally, it's into play. Wow. <laughs> nice impulse. Okay, he doesn't want to trade this life. Oh, he does. He does want to trade this life like me. Okay, we will take out the life like dude. We accept this offer. Oh, oh look. Now I have this. <laughs> I have this vampire specific. Pyro class, I mean, it doesn't work on this dude. Anyway, let's kill this. Luckily, we can blood away our vampiric vengeance. Oh no! Land first. Nice. Uh, okay, still land. Okay. Instant, right? Okay. <laughs> Okay, so we're going up to 10, taking 4. That leaves us at 6. I'm not sure if we have any removal that can kill this settlement. We already used the Grizzly Ritual. Right. Wait, wait, wait. Okay. We had nothing. Okay, we are now 33% of the way there. Alright, I got distracted by external factors during this game. Although, I'm not sure I wouldn't have made... Uh, okay, I wouldn't have made the same decision. I think for some reason in my head I was thinking the farmer transforms when it dies, not when another creature dies. That doesn't make sense. Okay. Okay. Okay, this is fine. The thing about this threatened vampire is we can just play it straight as a 3 3. Okay. Right, got nothing. See there, I, I probably should have played Mountain. Okay. See now I can make a misplay by going Swamp first. Oh, 
Oh, nice. Can attack for two. He said three colors. I guess the blood tokens are also good for like deck filtering. Make it, making it easier easier to splash. Is that true? I don't know if that's true. Okay. Th that one is annoying. Fairly strong. Okay, I think we'll trade with this. Fairly poorly. This was a mistake. Why did I do this? I should have waited until it was to be. Oh, nice. We can kill that. No, we can't. I should have gotten one of these. Huh. Wow, so many rares. Okay, uh... Feels like we should kill things. Definitely can't attack. Feel like we should kill this. We did get a uh, two plus one plus one counters for each human. Oh, that's pretty sweet. Alright, he's it's like an infinite blood he's some kind of infinite blood tokens combo. Infinite blood token combo. And they have the same pose.
I guess we get rid of this. He's more annoying in the long. He's the source of the the infinite blood combo. I think I'll attack. Gain some buffer. Nice. We have both attack. Then Skulking Killer can do his thing. I don't actually want to use up this blood these blood tokens. Because the stuff in my hand is useful. And we are in a fairly good position. He has nothing. Is everything in his hand double red? Alright. Okay. Right. Now we are forty percent of the way there. I can't say I'm pretty impressed with how the blood token mechanic is working out so far. And the card bots format for the transform cards is a bit hard to read. I feel like it should bunch together all the data from each side instead of name cost name type line type line anyway uh, this is this is surprisingly okay it's a bit risky but we have parasitic grasp. Make sure things don't get out of control. We have two of them. And given that our opponent has played forests. Uh, okay. See? He actually played a human for us. All 
right. Okay, the downside is now it's night. Okay. Now we can't kill it. First time chat. Do you have a regular streaming schedule? I do not. I just stream when I want it. I'm not here for... I'm not trying to build an audience or anything silly like that. Right, so we're going to take three. Oh, wow. I guess we should kill that. What's up, streamer fun com A4? Are you... You're not here to sell something, are you? Alright, the problem is this guy is going to get big. But this guy is going to get him to go wide. I think this one is more dangerous. If we draw a mountain... We did not draw a mountain. Alright. Uh, Parasitic Grasp gave us a bit of a buffer. Oh boy! <laughs> so that this one is another one of the three big bombs in the format. Okay, we're just going to lose immediately. Alright. Even if I had drawn a mountain, that would have been pretty bad. I have no way to get rid of uh, that hexproof werewolf person. Okay, this is not a good start. They're not doing well. Okay. This is pretty decent opening. We have removal and a can trip and a creature on three. Wretched song. <sighs> Alright, so if he's playing that, he probably has more than one of them, right? Man. Back? Let's play this first. Right. He's thinking about whether to use his removal on my squire. Guess not. All right. What am I, a farmer? I can attack safely.
Now, streamer fund column A4 never got back to me. Sometimes I think about having a regular streaming schedule, but that feels like an obligation, an unnecessary obligation. Now you have two problems. A regular losing schedule. Haha, <laughs> very funny. I'm surprised he isn't jump blocking with the thong, unless. With the throng? Thong. Unless that's his only one. Should be silly. Let's use this up. Okay. We are currently 2 and 2. So, we actually aren't doing super well. He's still attacking with it. Okay, so he's going to exploit. Getting back his parasitic grasp. Okay, we are also going to exploit. Be our guest. I haven't seen you play. Yes, I have not drawn that demon yet. And for some reason, I'm discarding the sixth land. I keep discarding the sixth land. I need to play Grizzly Ritual. But it's like he got back his uh, Parasitic Grasp. It might get him back up to six. But then he'll only have two mana left to play with, so he might not have anything. Alright, he'll play a blocker. Alright, I think we can uh, blood away the courier bat, because if we draw land, we win. Oh, we win. I can't. I, I couldn't actually use the bat since. Oh wait, I do have a creature in my graveyard now. I think winning the game is better than using the bat. Winning the game is a more exciting thing to do. Right, three two. Alright, let's get there. Just a bit more. I feel like... Um, have all our wins been the ones where we're on the play? I feel like the deck is really good on the play. Oh, StreamerFuncom A4 has followed me on Twitch. That's nice. Value is better than winning, though. Okay, so opponent goes first. So, that's a negative. On the other hand, we have a pretty good curve. We have a 2 into a 3. Ha, <laughs> and he mulligan. Okay, I think I think we'll do this one first. It's a bit more aggressive. I 
And we it can give us our first blood token to help transform the recluse, maybe. What am I a farmer? <laughs> oh, so the flavor of this is when his horse died. He becomes a depraved harvester, which is a knight, for some reason. A tragic moment pushed him to a blasphemous act. But blasphemous act is like minus 13, minus 13. Okay, I'll take the 6. I love farmer art. Hello again, first time viewer. Wow. I'm getting I got I've gotten two first time viewers today. E Lico349. The art is okay, but I I feel sad for that horse. Right, so get us a blood token and transform our farmer. Lifelink mode enabled. This is pretty good for a common, actually. We'll play this, then we'll transform it. I think I'll actually discard the dominate, dominating vampire. How do I get a bat? Oh, you mean the 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 bat, right? Okay. We we'll play wedding security, even though we don't actually have blood tokens. Anyway, the farmer helped us climb back from the early aggro. Ah, oh, my wedding security got bled dry. I, I don't like drafting this blood fountain. It gives you late game value. But it's like, I don't know. It's like the same reason I don't really like drafting race dead. Bat's useless again. No! The odious witch can trigger the bat because I drain for one when it attacks. And I also have lifelink, lightning helix, whatever. Parasitic grasp. Okay, gonna make me sacrifice a creature. I guess we'll sacrifice the witch. Oh, there's the bat. Actually, we might as well transform it.
Okay, many he's Okay. Will you attack for ten? Okay, I still have indestructible. Are you human? You are indeed human. Okay, the problem is it's going to transform. Okay, I'm tempted to use this now. No, I'll let it transform. So that we can still protect this knight. The problem is it's going to deal 7 to us, which is fairly annoying. Why does the, uh, the Dire Strain Anarchist art looks like he's playing a, a guitar? Alright, he still hasn't found what he's looking for. Nice. Is he going to exploit? Okay. Oh, he's still attacked. That's nice. Alright, so... I'm doing this on my turn for value. Okay, uh, what do we get? Uh, I guess dominating vampire. So that if you place a 2, we can take control of it. Oh yes, and that turns it into day. You just wanted to do the value play. We still haven't drawn our bomb, by the way. Did I even put it in the deck? I should double check <laughs> after this match. Okay. Did he miscount? <laughs> I think he miscounted. No, I'm pretty sure I put it in the deck. That would be silly. See, he's there. Oh, he's a 7 to last. For some reason, I was thinking he was a 6. One more win to fulfill the prophecy. We can exceed the prophecy, it's allowed. Okay, we're going first. Okay, we have a cantrip, we have a three drop. 
We have some removal if things get out of control. Okay, let's do this. Poo man. Oh, and he mulligan. Oh no! A lantern bearer. Whatever shall I do? I wish they would have made something like this target creature you control so that it doesn't give me priority every time. Be our guest. Do you go against players with the same record or just same division? I think the matchmaking is... I'm not sure exactly. I imagine they, they try to match you for people that are on the same rank, limited rank. Okay. Oh, there he is. All right, let's do this. There he is, but now we don't have enough lands. Oh boy. Okay, I think I have to discard the demon. We can get him back later, maybe. This guy can get annoying. And he might gain flying. Ah, it might have been better to attack into it first. With the belligerent guest. Since we have parasitic grasp to finish it off. Okay, we can kind of raise him. Okay, he can get forest. That's annoying. Okay, uh... I think I'm going to discard Pummeler. Wow. Okay, so it's a problem that he's going to start creating insects. Oh, right. Can't do that. Oh, this might be it. Oh no. Ah! He's got an excellent draw. We are doing so poorly.
Despite the fact that we've already done double blood. Okay. What can we do? I think we'll play this since it can trade favorably. And then, you know what? I'm going to do this. The witch can't do any favorable bl blocks at the moment anyway. Okay, we can turn this around if we draw a swamp. Yeah. I think that's our only hope for turning this around. All right. Okay, we're going to eat. We're going to four. Okay, we're going to eat. I'm surprised he traded that. Amazing. Okay. Okay, let's see what happens. <laughs> we are very soft to any kind of removal. Okay, I believe we can transform we can transform one of his insects into a dreadfast demon. I believe that works. My god, am I going to really going to turn this around? Okay. I believe that works. Yes! What do you mean not enough vampires? I have four flying... four six six flyers! This is amazing! Oh, you mean not enough vampires to get the insect? The insects have zero, have zero, their tokens. They have zero casting cost. Wow, amazing! After so many games of uh, being absent, <laughs> our bomb showed up and 
turned everything around for us. The dominating vampire counts itself, so it can get a one casting cost or less. <sighs> Amazing. That was the one game where he showed up. Clutch. I guess... I guess he only shows up when we need him the most. Okay. <laughs> the prophecy has been fulfilled. Now we must exceed the prophecy. Yes, mana value. Casting cost. Okay, I heard this pretty dumb, but at least this time we can cast Parasitic Grasp. Okay, <laughs> time to lose. Time to fulfill the prophecy. Time to bring balance to the force. Excellent. Oh, man. Did Amon Cat come out because they exceeded the prophecy? I don't know. I don't pay attention to lore. Okay, best case is if he plays an X2. You are not an X2. You are not an X2. I'll take it. So that we have the blood tokens. Bwahaha. Trade offer accepted. Okay, why would you trade with the 3 2 and not with the 4 2? Oh, he has tricks up his sleeve. I see. Well, in that case... In that case, okay. Alright, I think he's stuck on four lands. Okay. There's no reason not to attack. I can't. But that dominating vampire was clutch, also. Basically, our rares coming through for us in our darkest hour. I am! I am winning! I'm at 5 and 2. The prophecy is about to be exceeded. Okay, maybe just fulfilled. What do you mean I should not win anymore? Oh man, does he have another one of those things? Amazing. Conditions are perfect. Surely he doesn't have a third adamant will. Okay. Right, good night, Paxi. 
Come back next Wednesday. We'll prob I'll probably be drafting again on Wednesday. It's like you gave up on a certain streamer. Who did he give up on? Another human. Do you have someone good to get? I think I'll get the pummeler back. Did I do today's crossword? This isn't a crossword stream, you can't ask me that. Oh, nice. Let's play a couple of dudes. But no, I haven't done today's crossword. I didn't do yesterday's either. I feel like that's super brave. This is the guy with two adamant wheels. Does he really have another one? Right, I guess... Here. Oh, he, he had two of that guy. Interesting.
okay. Oh, nice. This deck is so weird. I'm totally losing to it though. Need the blockers. All right, player fatty. Surprisingly, the Bloodsworn Knight might help me turn this around. Remember your training. Okay. Is he planning to give his sharpshooter double strike? That won't work. I'm indestructible. I'm surprised he's not using the life link though. Now what? Now the odds are in my favor. Okay, I think I think I'm still winning this race. 
Just barely. Doing the math. Are you a human? The prophecy has been exceeded. Huh. I think I had a good feeling about this draft. How we managed to turn that around. Uh, the opponent did take a bunch of weird choices. Alright. Let's finish this last match. I guess I'm not doing a second draft today. This one went well anyway. It's better to go to sleep with a win. Okay. Although, it was a big stroke of luck that I got this far. I basically top-decked a swamp to win that game with the, with the demon. Ooh, man. White bodes well for humans. White and green! Uh, not human. Nice. Then we can s skulking killer the wolf on our turn. I love it when there's value. So he's stuck at three land, so I'm, I don't want to give him any extra draws yet. Okay, fine. Oh no, I've been I'm being oppressed. Don't you look Don't you look at my desperate farmer like that? You too can have a life like you. Oh, 
Okay, I think we'll attack her. We'll attack her. Give up this bat. Honestly, the four three life link is super enticing. Okay. All right. Now we have vengeance. Actually, be able to block. Play the pummeler for four. Might he have a wrath? Might have a wrath. Let's just hold up blood. We are invited to the wedding, and you are not. Really? Uh, two attackers. Get block. And you can't be blocked. Why didn't you use your tapper? Uh, it would have been the same outcome. Yes! Second seven win draft. We did well to wait. We did well today, chat. Thanks for keeping me company, Maru, and also Paxi from earlier. I had a good feeling. We had a pretty good deck. Okay, I like how the the whole blood mechanic played out. We have uh, we have defeated the prophecy. We, we only got we only drew our bomb in one game, but that one game was enough. It was clutch. Okay, just taking a screenshot of the results. This is Vow Draft Four result. Oh no, this is Vow Draft Five. I, I guess Paxi will say now that red is the strongest color because my record in red is 7-7-2. Seven, seven, excellent, excellent. That one game decided the fate of the entire universe. Alright, thanks for keeping me company. I'm out probably... Next stream will probably be on Wednesday evening around the same time. Thanks for watching. Keep safe, take care. Remember, there's still a pandemic. 
wash your hands, wear face masks, etc. Ending stream. Goodbye.